Hello, it's me, Nerdy, and welcome to the pr to the starting episode of Nerdy School Show. Smarts, get over here for our premiere. Wait, this is our first episode, isn't it? Yeah, it is, but I guess this could use a first episode and no premiere. Isn't a premiere a full episode, Nerdy? Uh, I don't know, Smarts, but let's just move on. This is the... <laughs> Nerdy show where we learn about random things every single day. And in the random things, we always have someone to interview. When we learn, it's very educational for different grades, it's very medicational, and it's fun and it's smart. So that's why you should watch the smart show. So Art, I hired someone to interview, since you clearly don't know magnetism. I do know, but I think your interviewer could speak it better. Okay, let's move on to the interviewer. Interview, now you can speak. Hey, smarts. I'm here to tell you have some questions about magnetism. That's actually true. Well, what did you want to know? I want to know the basics of magnetism and how it works, and how it affects us in daily life. So, Smarts, you wonder why I brought you here? No, and this chair is really comfy, by the way. Well, have you ever wondered why the metal frames behind me aren't attracted to each other? That's, why, that's what we're trying to answer this whole, this whole video, or I guess our show. Well, the main principle of magnetism is that... Most metal particles, especially iron, can carry an electrical charge, and that charge could be either positive or negative. And depending on how, how much of an electric charge each of them has, and depending on which polarity, positive or negative, sometimes the, the electrical field that surrounds these objects will pull them together. And so, opposite charges attract, and negative, and the same charges repel. So, how does this actually affect us in real life? Well, our, er, our planet Earth has a huge iron core, and there's a huge ma that generates a huge magnetic field around Earth. And because of that, it actually protects us from the rays of the sun, it protects us from meteor impacts, it affects the, the tides, lots of stuff. Wait, how do you know this? Do you know this because you're a magnet? Eh... Kind of. Okay, here's that dumb dog show next door, so don't mind it. I see. I see. He has quite some animal magnetism. But um. But um. So today we just learned about magnetism. Was that interesting, learners? When did we learn about magnetism? I thought we were gonna learn about magnetism right now. We did, doofus! I really hope you enjoyed our first Smart Show episode. I really want you to go and subscribe to EB2HD and Brandon Kennedy. So, if you, if you liked... Leave a like and please subscribe for more nerdies, smarts, show.